Yo, what is going on guys, Houndish here, and today I'm back with another Destiny video, and this video is going to be a quick and effective run of this week's Nightfall Strike, which is of course the Taken version of the Winter's Run Strike, meaning that you've got a chance to get the Stolen Will Shotgun, because this is notoriously difficult to get inside of the Vanguard Heroic playlist, and of course, as well as all this, your loot chance for the shotgun is much better inside of this Nightfall Strike, so I'm going to show you how you can run this strike in 10 minutes or less with a good team right here. So what you're actually going to want to use is Telesto because Specialist is on as a modifier this week as well as Exposure. So what you want to do is have Telesto and you can use pretty much anything else that you want but having a Titan, a Hunter and a Warlock here will be pretty useful. Night Stalker to tether the boss at the end and Weapons of Light as well for that bonus damage. So you're just going to come into this first room, use Telesto on all the groups of adds that are kind of piled up together. You'll take them down pretty quickly. Telesto is also really good because Trickle is on this week, so you're not going to get your abilities as fast, meaning when Telesto does generate orbs, that's going to be pretty useful for your supercharges. So you're just going to get through there, move out into this first outside area, clear all the adds that are here at the start, and then of course you deploy the ghost. Now there's two separate waves of adds in this section of the strike, so what you want to do is just come up onto these cliffs and literally just Telesto all the groups of enemies down below. Just keep doing it. If you team shot with Telesto, right here you're gonna absolutely melt everything in this area really really quickly so the first wave will be predominantly hobgoblins and scions down on the lower level once you've cleared this out you will get another wave that spawn sniper vandals up on the top level where these cliffs are so you're gonna to want to be really careful and get these out quickly and then you can just continue as you were doing before killing the ads down below as they try to push up this whole section of the strike literally takes two two and a half minutes to complete as you can see we're just team shotting those centurions right there they're getting absolutely melted moving on to the ash cove section this is where everyone famously drives their sparrow through very quickly and that is what we're going to do right here so just kind of zigzag as you come past these monitors because they will pretty much one shot you it's not too difficult to get past and then once you get through to this bottom section right here if you stick to the left hand side you have a fair amount of cover you jump off your sparrow get straight up over the top there and you'll find yourself at the boss so essentially when the boss spawns you're going to want that weapons of light bubble and a tether preferably and this is where you'll need black spindle or a high impact sniper in general can be pretty useful. You can use Telesto but two black spindles that we had on the team right here as you can see we're doing a hell of a lot of damage with that weapons of light and tether. You will have adds around you but you can pretty much kill him in one go if you have enough DPS. We are all 330 plus but I wouldn't imagine being you know around 320 ish would make much difference and as you can see we've managed to take that boss out pretty rapidly now my friends both of them managed to get the shotgun on our first run of this uh, another one of my friends got it on the second run I haven't got lucky yet and had one dropped but we know obviously that it will drop very commonly in this strike so you can grind for it the way I've shown you right here there may as well be like a trip mine cheese type thing or some way that you can trade kill with the boss to repeat the boss but it's going to be very tricky because he's got a lot of health and your only bonuses are going to come from special ammo anything else isn't going to do a lot of damage so i haven't really explored that but you can run this strike in eight to ten minutes with a good team so there you go guys just a quick farm for this week's nightfall increase your chance of getting that stolen will shotgun so let me know down below if you've managed to pick it up in this week's nightfall if the video has been useful drop a like as always and if you're new to the channel feel free to hit subscribe for a lot more but for now you guys take it easy i'll catch you very soon